Hey, what's up? A long time no see, but I'm excited to say that we have a little adventure for you today. So let's get all our stuff, pack the car, and head out. Hey. Hey. Hey, Poo Poo. You ready? Let's go. Okay, now that we're on the road, I'm gonna break down the itinerary for you. We have three places that we're stopping in about mm, 48 hours. First one we're going to is Cape Disappointment. It's supposed to be beautiful there. We're gonna set up like uh, our picnic chairs, eat a little bit of lunch, and then we're gonna check into our hotel uh, and kind of get ready for clamming. So we're gonna go clamming for Pacific Razor Clams. This is kind of our second attempt after a failed first attempt with some family. Uh, but we're gonna do that. We're gonna take you guys along with us. And then the third stop is gonna be tomorrow morning. It's gonna be a little bit of a surprise, but I'll drop little hints in the video, see if you can kind of figure those out. We have about two and a half hours left on our road trip. And Sarah, are you getting a little hungry? I can eat Yeah? Okay, let's see what we got. Uh, yeah, we got Baby Ruth. You want some of that? Meanwhile, enjoy the Pacific Northwest in the winter. Now we just parked, but we got to figure out how to get up to the lighthouse. Um, the lighthouse will have like the best view, kind of looking out into the ocean. Um, and it seems like a pretty calm day today from our drive. So it's like no crazy winds. So that means no like king tides. Usually it'll like sweep all the way up to the mountain top, but uh, it's supposed to be pretty. Lead the way. So usually when it's storming really, really hard, the waves will actually kick up all the way up here. There's like photos of it. There's the lighthouse. We're gonna head over there. But look at that. Ooh, do you hear that? So in about 0.6 miles, that way, we should be able to get to the lighthouse. Okay, this is a secret little spot. We're gonna have lunch down here, but I forgot the picnic chairs. Oh. Oh. Uh, and, the, and the lunches. <laughs> so we're just gonna go down there, following kind of that path that these folks are on. Let's walk down there. Making the trek down. It's pretty steep. Some of these steps are only six, six inches wide. It's 
pretty slippery because the mud all has some moisture in it. So these don't really have the best grip, eh? Okay, I'll show you guys the tree in a second. I'll get a better shot, but I want to climb up here. <laughs> oh, nice little tide pools are rolling. Sarah never wants to let poo poo by the water. I guess up doesn't really get us anywhere. I should go down and then head over that way. It's a little bit of a jump, so let's go back. Ooh. Ooh. I should probably take off my socks. Hmm. Sarah would yell at me if I went out there, like on that rock, and looked out that way. Could you, uh, I'm actually just gonna take a seat here for a second. There's the tree. It's like one tree on this little rock island. There's Sarah telling me not to go any deeper. Oh shit. All right, we made it back. Sarah was kind of yelling at me. Can you see the tree? Me, you, and Popo. beautiful we're gonna finish up the lighthouse walk then heading back up and then the lighthouse should be up there somewhere I'm assuming all right let's go there's where we were and now we're still climbing
can see Japan over there. Hey, my Japanese. All right, there's the. Can we climb on this one? This one doesn't say don't climb. No trespassing, okay. Whew. So there's a lighthouse. Yeah. Like that's it for America. <laughs> that's it. Here's the summit view. So this entire rock face here on King Tide, so just sweep all the way up. Okay, I can confirm that that is Oregon over there, which is actually our third stop. But for now, we have to get back down. Nice little hike done. Yeah, perfect. It was yeah. Um, but I'm running out of battery, so we'll see you guys when I were charged up, ready to go claiming. See you later. So this is our stay for the night. Adrift, they have a fourth floor restaurant. Looks pretty nice. Um, We'll take you through a little later, but right now we're gonna head out before the sun sets too much more. Got some picnic chairs, our clamming gun. And uh, we're just gonna head down this way, right on the beach. And we're gonna try out some clamming. Uh, let's see how that goes. But here's where we'll be spending the next eh, two hours or so. I mean, the sooner we get all of our clams, the sooner we can get back home, but you know, if we're out here for two hours until the sun sets in the dark, I have flashlights and headgear so Sarah can strap on some headgear. Oh <laughs> and uh, we'll stay out all night if we have to. I'm getting 15 and Sarah's getting her 15 limit. Let's go. That's a sign. We should be hitting uh, peak low tide in about mm, an hour or so, roughly. Uh, so tide's gonna still be going out. <laughs> Crab legs. Steven just caught his we first, first one. one! Oh my god! Look at him! Oh, oh. he's a little scared guy. Nice, look at that. That was like in this like three one. minutes of being here. Okay, so let's leave that there for a second. Let's take a okay. little. Okay. So this little thing might be something, Let's so see. I'll try it. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. So the first time you go in, you might not get anything. Uh huh. They're gonna dig down deeper. So. Okay. Can you check their feet? Yep. Nothing in that one. Oh! Still? Yeah, you technically have to keep all the ones you get. You can't okay. return them back just because you're not happy with them. Okay. That's three in like. That's three in, in like, like a couple minutes. minutes. Yeah. 
Okay, let's just find some more. Let's go. Ready? Yeah. Let's see that. There's another one. Put it in the pile. One. Kind of breaking them. There Sarah goes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, go back in a second time. Go, go, go before it runs away. Ah! Are you holding ah! the dot? Yeah. Oh. No okay. dice. Let's try again. So we might just have run out of luck. I think we got the three. I'm wearing the headlight. Sarah's got my uh, torch light. And we're kind of looking around and no more uh, dimples are showing up. And it's getting kind of dark, which is fine. But if nothing shows and the tide keeps coming in, we're probably gonna call it a little early. Hey, we're gonna keep looking. We just got like three so far. is our clamming trip. I think we spent oh, about an hour. Yeah. We kind of messed up. So if you remember, we weren't in the car and now we are in the car. Uh, did some reading and we were like, there was a better better beach to go to and it was a 30 minute drive. So we quick dashed. I mean, sunset was like 4.30 and we got here at like 4.40. Yeah. Ran out to the beach. Luckily we got those few, but then the sunset and now, uh, and now it's completely dark. It's like pitch black. Yeah. Kind of spooky. Kind of spooky, but kind of cool though. So we'll drive on the beach back and we'll go home. There were some deer, so we'll try not to hit any deer, but otherwise we got venison. Um, but once we get back, we have like a distillery, like a free distillery tasting. Yeah. Um, we'll grab some dinner and we'll take Poopoo out. Okay, so we just got back from our wine tasting, but this is our cup. This is the, the best one here. Jeez, look at that. This is a meaty, hefty guy. Look at it. What do you think? What did I just do? <laughs> do it again. Did I make it pee? Only that one. Ooh! Push out some water, yeah. Damn, that one is golden. Just picked up dinner. We got the steak Diane, the crispy ducks, uh, crispy skin duck, and the mac and cheese with crab. First one is, oh bro, I was like, I was like, yo, is there like a lot of crab in there? And she was like, yeah, brother. Eh. Better be good though. Sure Here's like the lounge area on our floor. Got a few games. Ping pong there. And Boop. So here's a little bit of tour. We got some bathrobes. Uh, it is a spa hotel. They have a sauna, a pool, maybe some like massage services, I think, right? Oh, uh, yeah, they have a massage. You can do your nails. You can get your nails you done. You can get your lashes and eyebrows tinted. A decent amount of spa and self care services. This is the bathroom. Pretty standard, but uh, clean, huge. Again, that's the sink. Kind of strange, but not bad. And decent sized bed. Very interesting. It's very clean. It's like cork. Um, cute little fridge. 
but I'm ready to dig in. All right, here it is. So this is the duck. It's the mac and cheese with crab. This is the steak Diane. That looks good. So I say we start with this. Sarah, I'm gonna get you a little piece. There's, ooh. Okay, so this is like a really creamy mushroom. Chanterelle? I don't know, something like that. For you, let's do a nice piece of steak. And Tao. Hey, I got a small mouth. Mm. You got it on your... Ooh, yeah, that's good. The duck. Mm. There's a sauce there. Mm -hmm. It's really, it's like, you got a hint of sweet to it. I was gonna say the sauce on the steak is really good too. Mm -hmm. The duck is really good. All right, let's do a quick little. Mmm. So good. Mm. I like features. I mean, crab flavor comes through a lot. Mm. That's really good. Mm. Mm. All right, well, that was today. We have our last stop tomorrow morning, and then we're heading back home. So really short trip, but Fun. let me just kind of show you guys how it went. Um, we're going to down this, watch some Harry Poplar, mm -hmm. and, uh, and then head to bed. So we'll mm -hmm. see you guys tomorrow. And good morning. Good morning. Uh, we're gonna set up some chairs, just kind of watch the waves roll in. I might take another stab at uh, a few more clams, but we'll see. Just kind of relaxing, grab some breakfast maybe, and then head out to Astoria uh, around noon. Heading out. What is that? Oh, that's so sad. It's one of those little seabirds. Sarah and Poopo are staying. It's starting to drizzle a little bit, but I'm gonna just take a few little stabs in the sand. Uh, just kind of being wary of the waves. Woo! So I had the camera set here and the waves were all the way out there. So that one snuck in on me. Hopefully those folks don't get stuck. Oh, he's coming. out this morning we're on the beach for a little bit and now it's kind of coming down uh, we're gonna make our way to Astoria um, it's about like a 30 minute drive and uh, oh <laughs> but, but, just want to say that this place great highly recommended they had a spa with a sauna pool with adult time that means. <laughs> the beach down there everything you could have super dog friendly too oh distillery Free complimentary drink tastings, gin, whiskey, liqueur, um, all local. So it was very nice, but we are headed to Astoria and then we're gonna make our flight tomorrow heading back to Milwaukee. So short trip, we'll see you in Astoria. Okay. We don't wanna be uh, disrupting their privacy. So we're gonna make this quick, but we're at our last stop and we're gonna show you where that is. Oh, do you know where we are? Put it in the comments down below. But thanks for coming with us. That wraps up our trip. We're gonna head back home. So until next time. Peace out. Baby Ruth. <laughs>